Hey guys, I'm just gonna show off a bug today. Uh, Yak15, I did a video on it, that was the last patch. This is the new patch. Look at its stat sheet, 469, blah blah, blah. this is max out, as you can see, max, blah 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 blah, max, 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 and here we go, test flight. Mostly battles, limited fuel. Let's do limited fuel and ammo. Okay, whatever, blah blah, blah. doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Uh, let's do it at dusk, you know? Okay. And it'll load in. Okay, load it in, blah blah, blah. take off, flaps. Well, it was raised. Full throttle, here we go. I'll do it whenever we get airborne. Now, on this patch, the Yak Chain is a bit more maneuverable at lower speed. Um, you take off a bit faster, you do a lot of other stuff a bit faster, but, where am I at, okay, alright, just need to gain speed now, and I'll show you another, okay, and this is the bug right here, as you can see, I am going 420, miles an hour and redlining there we go redlining now on the stat sheet it said that I could reach 469 and last patch I could reach 510 before my wings got ripped off and now we just watch and wait I'm redlining at 425 and wings will rip off and there we go or 43 if I'm right as you can see I'm at a plus a negative 5 444 and I think it's 446 See, it, it doesn't even reach the speed it used to. They altered the flight model a lot. I mean, I like the more maneuverability at lower speed. That's nice. But this is a jet. Which goes against other jets sometimes. Iffy on that. Okay, uh, 447. There we go. The wing rips off at 447. Yep, there's the other wing. And yeah. Last patch, the it redlined at five hundred and the wings ripped off at five ten. That was the last patch. New patch, completely altered flight model, doesn't will not reach the speed that it says it will reach on the stack card. So they took a perfectly good flight model, which it really was. It was a really nice flight model for this. And ruined it. They ruined it. Yep. As you can see there, 469. And I was not on the um, regular speed. Indicated airspeed is what I was on. Because that tells you how fast you're going in the air. Not how fast you're going compared to the ground beneath you. And I was not at the max altitude. So. Okay guys, this time I'm going to do it just as that sheet says. It, it says the Yak-15 can reach 469 at 4000 meters altitude. So what I'm going to do is I have set it into custom battles, realistic, operation, whatever, lash convoy. This is realistic. And I'm going to show you what it is like at 4,000 meters, as the stat card says. Okay, 4,000 meters test. Wait, what's going on? Oh, they, I might, oh, 
Oh, as long as my AI won't matter. I'll still be up here. Okay, instead of climbing now, do my speed. See, uh, do the positioning of the engine. In order to maintain level flight, you need to be a bit lower than you think you should be. So really, whenever you're at uh, 15 degrees, you're more than likely at 20 degree climb. That's what it acts like anyway. Which, I guess that's realistic, but turns out in level flight you have to have your uh, nose pointed down for level flight. Okay. Looks like I'm gaining altitude and steadily somewhat gaining speed. Maybe. I don't even know if I can reach 469 at this. I'll tell you if I can. That's for sure. Mm, doubt it. Really doubt it. About to go off the map here. Okay. Turn back around. And I am seriously doubting that I can actually reach the speed of 469 at 4,000 meters. Seriously doubting this. Which, that's what the stack card said. On 400 meters, 4,000 meters, I can reach the speed of 469 miles an hour. Not happening. See? Even in descent. It looks like this is my max speed at uh, 4,000 meters. Oh, no. Oh, that's because I'm a steady dive, though. Pull a bit up from a dive. It's really hard to try and level this thing out. Because the AI tries to take over. Okay, yeah, I cannot reach the, sp the speed of 469 from 4,000 meters. Lovely. Alright, well, uh, that's the new flight model update for the Act 15. It's uh, worse, and I would not recommend going for it anymore. I mean, yeah, it's still fun, maneuverable. It's, well, it's still the most maneuverable. Well, I. I, I I think it's the most maneuverable jet. I think they removed the maneuverability from it, really. I remember it being a lot better. Also, the combat flaps now rip off whenever you're going this speed. See? Watch. The combat flaps is what really made this jet. Now it's just bad. It's just bad now. Uh, yeah. That's it. Yak 15. New flight model. Uh, worse. Way worse. Can even reach its top speed. And when it can reach its top speed, uh, the wings fall off. Yep. Okay. Well, that's it. <sighs> Disappointing. I mean, they said they were going to give a lot of jets new flight models and everything, but why change it from the stat sheet? Why make it worse than the stat sheet? Oh, because we dropped it in battle rating by 0.3. Yeah, this can't even reach it. The X-17 can't even reach it. The wings rip off too fast. And there's no patch notes about changing the flight model of the Act 15. I couldn't find. I could not find any. So uh, yeah. Okay, guys. Bye.